So today, we have just looked at Deuteronomy chapter 7 verse 9 and specifically, I just want to focus and highlight this to anyone that's watching in Australia or anywhere in America, Singapore, Malaysia. This two words is Ha'el. Say it together with me, Ha'el. 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 So what does this mean? Ha'el, Hane Eman is Ha'el. L is for God. Hane Eman is the Ha is the Neeman is faithful. But actually, what I haven't shared with you is Aman or Aman is actually something that you have said all your life. It's the word Amen. So when you say Amen. You are saying that God is reliable, God is faithful, and God is trustworthy. Mm. So today you have learned something really powerful. Mm. That even Pepper is saying hello, Hallelujah. What he says is Hallelujah. Imperative praise the Lord. Mm. Amen. He's faithful. And Hael, Hanayman, is the faithful God. Remember this. Ha'el, Hane'eman is the faithful God in Deuteronomy chapter 7 verse 9. Mm. This was one of those three long sermons that Moses repeat. Mm. Deuteronomos is the second giving of the law. Nomos is law. Deuteronomo is the second. In Moses, in Deuteronomy, Moses is saying and reflecting on God, the faithful covenant keeping God. And this word Hane'eman comes from the root word Aman which you have used all your life as Amen. And that means faithful, reliable, trustworthy. Hallelujah. Okay? Beautiful. Thank you. So, um,